Hey guys and gals, it's Sweet Project Cards here with cool, trick, and affordable ways and simple ways for the do-it-yourselfer. We're here back with our Darth Vader. I had one of our comments come in and say, this kind of looks like Darth Vader. I guess maybe if you tip it up, it looks a little bit like Darth Vader. Anywho, we are going to do vinyl today. How to recolor your vinyl and have it last and be pliable and not peel off or wear off. All right, let's get started. We've got it all taped off now and we are ready to go. We use this blue tape instead of yellow body tape because it is not as sticky and it works much better when you're using it on plastic and or vinyl or leather. If you do body work, of course, you always want to use your yellow tape. First thing we're going to do is clean it with our 99% before we use our prep spray. This will work on leather the same exact way, only you'll use a different prep spray for leather, and I will make sure that that is uh, in the show more of the video description, and our Spanish host is here. Take it away, Julio. Buscar en el show más de la descripción de video para todas las herramientas. All right, as I said, we'll clean it with our 99%. As this is one of our secrets. That's how dirty it was. Now we will use our vinyl prep. And we will wipe it off again. Preparation is key when you're doing plastic, vinyl, or leather. One more time. This removes all the grease, garbage, everything that's possibly on here that will make your paint fisheye. That's usually what happens when people do leather, plastic, or vinyl, it fisheyes because there's grease or wax or something that is in or on the material. We're using a slightly different black on this, slightly different color, and they have every color you can just about think of. All right, there's the first coat. We'll let that dry 10 minutes and we'll be back. All right, let's do our second coat. Make sure you shake it up a minute or two. There is no better way to color your leather or your vinyl with, than this right here. No better way. All right, there's our second coat. We will be back to do the third. All right, let's do the last coat once and for all. There we go, it's done. And I'll give you uh, some better pictures of it here when it dries and gets the true color. That way you can get an idea of what it looks like. All right, it's all done and it's gorgeous. It looks like real leather. 